Hey guys, Dennis and Melinda here with you today to tell you a quick story. This involves uh, our Patreon team and something that we're doing as a special gift to all of those who become members of our Patreon team between now and September 23rd. Uh, you've heard me talk about the Blessing Song. Uh, it's a song that uh, I wrote for a family that became friends of ours way back in the late 1980s. Yeah. And uh, just to tell you a quick story, we were a part of a church in the from the mid 80s to the early 90s called Western Hills Church in Oklahoma City. And we had morning prayer time, Monday through Friday from six to seven every morning. And I would often lead those times of prayer from the piano using the Lord's Prayer as uh, a pattern. We would worship, hallowed be thy name. Then we would mm -hmm. ask the people to pray for God's kingdom to come in the lives of our families, of our church, of our city, of our state, of our nation, of the world. And uh, we spent, uh, even an hour wasn't enough some yeah, days. It was an prayer. awesome time. And I noticed one morning there was a man I hadn't seen before and we would have tons of people come every morning but mm -hmm. on this particular morning I met this man and I just went up to him and I introduced myself to him and I said what's your name and he said my name is Wayne Fagala and I said what brings you to town and he said well we were just, we just heard about your prayer gatherings and about your worship times and about your church and we wanted to find out firsthand and I just felt prompted to say well why don't you bring your family over right to have dinner with us tonight. And he said, are you sure? Don't you need to ask your wife? And I said, <laughs> I know what she'll say. Right. And so uh, I said, bring your wife and your kids. And he said, well, we have my mother-in-law with us too. The more the merrier. And, uh, <laughs> we, that's what I said, the more the merrier. So they all came and we had a great time. And I'll let Melinda share some of what happened that night. Well, we um, were just always prepared for extras and it just seems like the Lord always provided. So whatever I had in the home to fix, um, I'm not even sure what we had. I don't know. <laughs> it doesn't um, matter. It just divided. It was just almost miraculous. We just added two or it was extras. I don't know if it was uh, nachos. It might have been our nacho night. Who knows? But um, it was just simple and we just acted like they were part of the family and it was immediate the bond and connection with them and it was like Wayne and Kathy were our best friends that we had just reconnected with after seeing them hadn't seen them for a long time it's like we knew them already and our kids got together and instantly became friends and played and their mother-in-law was just like, well, how long have you guys known each other? And she was shocked because we had just met. And In fact, um, her yeah. mom said, Mom, we know, we've know we known the Jernigans as long as you have. Right. And she was still she shocked. She said, no, you're kidding. Right. We all have known each other a lot longer. The way you talk to each other, it's like, mm -hmm. no, we just hit it off. And yeah, we were fast instant friends. Instant connection. And that was in the late 80s. And then come May of 1991, mm -hmm. and the Lord called them away to a new work of ministry and it broke our hearts in a way. It really did hurt. Right. And, but I, I, the way I dealt with my grief was I asked the Lord for a way to bless the Fagalas as they were leaving. And on May the 20th of 1991, the Lord gave me a song called the blessing song. And it's been used for weddings. It's been used in TV shows. It's been used for wedding renewals, uh, graduations, uh, you name it. It's just a, a blessing directly from God's word. And uh, what, what I'd like to do is for all of those of you who become new members or current members of Patreon that uh, sign up at the $25 level or higher, mm -hmm. we'll send you a signed copy of the lyrics matted ready for framing yeah. between now and september 23rd i sang the song for the first time over the fabulous mm -hmm. and we bawled like babies right. and it's such a special song in fact uh i i went online just this past week 
and found version after version right. after version of people using the song in various situations and in different ways. And uh, it would just be uh, mean a lot to me and Melinda if you would consider supporting what God's called us to do by becoming a member of our Patreon team at the $23, $25 level right. or higher. Well, the reason that we want to bless you with this specific song, because I, I really feel like it is great to have it in your home as a on the wall and as a way to um, remember that um, the words of blessing over your family, over your children, are so important, and they're just straight from the scripture. I mean, God does it over and over for us, and it's a way to speak blessing over your children, over your wives, over your um, spouse, over your friends, over your family, um, and just a good remember of how the Lord does bless us with words, and it's good to just hear them, speak them, listen to them, and do it often because um, our words are life to each other. That's right, and we want to speak life to those around us. Right. We want to bless even those who curse us. Right. And so it would mean a lot to me if you would consider just looking over the Patreon page. Just go mm -hmm. to patreon.com slash Dennis Jernigan, right. and you'll find out why we're even doing this the way right. we're doing it. It's just become a good platform for us, mm -hmm. for ministry, uh, since I was sidelined with Parkinson's. And by sidelined, I mean I had to quit traveling. Right. I still continue to minister to this day. Right. And so I want you to know that. And with my dying breath, I'll keep pointing people to Jesus. And I just wanted to share my wife with you this morning because oh, she doesn't get to do a lot of Patreon stuff with me because she's a she's got a busy life of her own just with her business and all the grandchildren and then uh, hmm. February, we're going to have grandchild number 13, yes. so we're pumped. Yes, and you know, this these um, words of blessing are really important, and I feel like part of our ministry has been that Father's Heart ministry and speaking words of life and blessing over you, and if you have been a part of our ministry through the years, you know that, and we're not going to uh, stop doing that, and so I feel like this is a time that you can join us and to continue that and be a part of um, our continued ministry because we have no way ended our ministry just because we are not doing it in a public manner. But um, this is a way that you can be involved and remember us. And it's just a token of our appreciation. Yeah, consider becoming a member of our Patreon team right. and keep up with us. And we'll keep doing what God has called us to Thank do. Thank you so much. Just check it out. That's all we ask. Yeah. We love you guys so much and appreciate you going on this journey with us. We're in this together. Right. And you'd be a blessing today.